So yes, finally, 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 though, of course, I'm back with another really quick. Uh, of course, Pokemon Go, uh, Pokemon Go video, oh my lord. Scrap it, scrap the video, it's over, it's over, it's just end it, I'm just kidding, of course. But yeah, we got a new, of course, episode review for the next Pokemon series, or new, current one. Of course, though, but yeah. Um, so let's get started though, of course. Again, um, this episode is mainly focusing on Ash, of course, Leon training. Um, the real reason why Leon's training is because blah, 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 blah. And Go kind of goes off, I mean, they kind of go off their own journeys and stuff like that. <laughs> but yeah, they go off on their own journeys, they do their kind of own little thing in this episode. It definitely does make sense though, because again, this is literally the Darkest Day episode, part five. So yeah, it's kind of like that. It took some elements from the episode a little bit. Um, and again, a lot of episodes for Leon specifically though. So um, yeah, of course, can get started though. Again, last episode that I have reviewed and stuff like that, of course. I've already recorded, done everything, of course though, but um, edited probably as I was recording. Yeah, right, yeah, right. Of course, I'm not having edited already. Um, we just gotta get them uploaded. I've been recording so much lately though, so it's the kind of, I've been kind of going back and forth and stuff like that. Of course, so let's get started though, of course. Of course, the episode starts for Ash, but Go already went on. He's, um, he's going to catch more Pokemon and stuff like that, of course. And um, he's um, over here training his little stadium, of course, finding Flint though. So, of course, it'll be Elite Four, which I saw. So I was like, okay, that's kind of cool. So, of course, Ash and Pikachu rush up to the stadium, which is cool. And again, it's good to ask, like, his, his own little side episode though, from time to time. Slash Go, but yeah. It's good to say, I mean, it's kind of good not to see them together, kind of, but, um, I mean, like, it's, I mean, it's good to see them, like, together, but, like, in their own stuff. Because we had the Darkest Day episode, that was a perfect example of Ash and Leon doing their own thing, and of course, Tony and Go doing their own thing. Again, different, two different stories kind of combining into one, that's what this episode kind of does, and that's why I like for it, though, of course, we see, um, Flint, of course, um, Flint and Leon actually battling, though, of course, and it's really insane, because Leon utterly destroys him, like, holy crap, they're like, if any speed and power is really good, but Leon just... Utterly destroys him, like he utterly destroys him for an empty, which is crazy. Of course, Leon wins and stuff like that, of course, doing his pose and stuff like that, of course. Um, then of course, again, yeah, Flint, um, you know, um, uh, of course, Leon is helping Flint get back up and stuff like that, of course, encouraging him to keep trying hard and going hard, though, of course. But yeah, of course, we see, um, of course, Ash, um, being excited as well. It's kind of cool. I feel like they, uh, Flint could have been some sort of a bit saying hit Ash or whatever. But again, I think it's confirmed at this point that Jerry is gonna bring back everybody. I heard that from like a review or something like that. I can't remember. I, I gotta go back and check that. I think it's confirmed everybody's coming back. So I did do a short on something interesting. You guys could probably want to see that. I don't know. I haven't even done a thumbnail for that one at all. I have recorded it already, but I gotta get this over. Was Ash Fox Leon and stuff like that? Of course, taking photos, being happy and stuff like that. Of course, forget Chairman Rose because he just will help the face of the earth after that other episode. So yeah. Um, yeah, of course, I actually about Pittsburgh and stuff like that, of course. Then Leon, of course, I actually says I'd do like a training cool day for him, though. So, yeah, of course, um, Grookey and Go, we see their story on, um, you know, Go, typically catching new Pokemon and stuff like that. Of course, we got a Pokemon, of course, it kind of early. It's weird because he pulls the Ash, like, he literally gets up early and just flat out, um, just like, just, you know, just flat out goes on. Of course, we see the different versions of smaller, but bigger, I want to say low key versions of the bar Pokemon. I forgot all about it. <laughs> I forgot the name of it, though. So, of course, um, Go actually spots Ash and Leon, of course. So, and of course, he, Go wants to um, start to get more serious on his journey as well, though. Of course, we see Sonya pull up, of course. Uh, so, they just met up, got just out of the blue nowhere, though. So, yeah, again, then she literally just kidnaps Go so loud. Of course, he doesn't even want to go. He just follows, just goes on. And, of course, Ash and Leon go on, um, you know, and um, just a bit, like deeper in the forest to play. Of course, again, they, it's, it was confirmed that they're actually going on training day slash, you know, go right because yeah, he's from the intro and i kind of like it though and you will see him chloe ash chloe go and ash go and i say chloe, chloe. ash go ash uh, ash go and chloe of course in the car though it was confirmed it's coming up though of course they accidentally get lost though but nah not really though they just show training so far of course um again really that was real episode um reason to train this episode I actually do like though of course they actually run on charizard just slamming right into trees is going a full on crazy there of course sonya is reckless crazy driving as well of course getting herself more serious about her research um with her grandmother and stuff like that, of course. She's a former researcher now, because I think it's by the end of Sword and Shield, I think she was a researcher. And Hop is there too? I think so. I can't remember. But yeah, of course, they're train off um, um, uh, Leon Stars, I say Ash Stars, Ghost Stars, or whatever. Uh, Leon Stars starts to um, grab up the string by using Dragon Claw, of course, to dress rocks and boulder stones, but the whole waterfall and everything, of course, though. And of course, he call, um he switches out Dragonite. Like Free Fall, which actually is pretty cool. And of course, he calls out um was a drag cool. I can't remember the name of the Pokemon. No, sorry about that. But yeah, of course, actually they fly over our land, of course, with Wulu, and they start to actually just have fun um fall in there as well. They like just a fog and stuff like that, of course. And of course, um for showing in Ghost Park, of course they um researching more of the land and stuff like that, of course, can talk about like the differences and stuff like that. Of course, it's actually pretty funny though. But yeah, after that, of course, I would see Ash and Leon, of course, for themselves and stuff like that. Of course though. 
Um, yeah, of course, um, they see a whole, like, fuck, because um, Leon's trying to do that character right now, too. By the way, of course, they see, of course, the Sonya go go off, like, go on full conversation, so it's changing, it's something like, of course, probably about, like, Leon and stuff like that. Because they really haven't talked after the Darkest Day episode, though, so I feel like they need a, like, reunite episode, because they are best friends, it is true, they are best friends in the series and stuff like that, but then they kind of, like, drifted apart and stuff like that, of course. We see Ash and um, Leon, of course, having fun with the world and taking a break, snack, little snack break and stuff like that, of course. It's, it's good, like, to get, like, this type of episode, but, like, Leon outside the championship thing, because we really haven't seen him really outside the championship thing. He's always happy, smiling, and so on. Of course, I think Hop was coming into the anime. I can't remember. Of course, we see um, all Pokemon about playing. We obviously see some more Corviknight as well, though. So this is um, first ever, like, really interactive with Corviknight, um, which is actually pretty cool. Yeah, Corviknight is actually really good. I use it myself on Sword and Shield. It's actually really good. Of course, they actually start to um, fly around, starting um, trying to get rid of Ash and Leon. They, of course, start to fight back a little bit. So Ash kind of calmed down with the situation and stuff like that. Of course, Ash wants to, um, you know, form a battle, but Leon's you know, kind of like, let's take a little another, let's take another approach and stuff like that, of course. And um, let's follow them back and see like, what's happening. Of course, Leon actually takes off his shirt, which is good. Uh, so we got buff boy Leon in the anime. Let's freaking go. But yeah, of course. Oh my neck! I pulled out something. Oh my lord! Oh my lord! <laughs> um. Okay. Yeah, I did. I definitely did not stress this more than that much. But of course, we see Leon. Of course, cover the Corviknight. Um, just trying to understand him, trying to get him to calm down a little bit. Though, of course, and he actually finds it though. It's actually pretty cool. And of course, we actually discover that some rookie D's got um, or just you know, those are very rookie D's and. Here in the nest, of course, Ash um, discovers it and stuff like that. Of course, why they are um, fighting and stuff like that. Of course, again, Leon's kind of striking them while Ash is trying to figure out what's going on. And of course, um, of the Corviknight tried to, um, you know, um, get angry and accidentally poop over the babies. And of course, Ash falls and um, tries to save them and stuff like that. Of course, and he actually manages to do that though. He said like one of them, I think, was injured. So of course, Leon um, fixes up and stuff like that. So that's a really, really big reason. Against typical Pokemon logic and stuff like that, of course, that um, Pokemon usually get like stuff like this. Like, oh, I don't like Pokemon or like with the babies. Of course, they're just trying to like make sure like they don't get hurt or whatever. Though, so yeah, of course, you see all the Pokemon follow the land, of course, and see like the real reason why Leon's really training and stuff like that. Of course, again, he's super happy and laid back though. But the real reason really is why because he really felt helpless to get. The Get ready for the situation. He couldn't really catch it and so on, of course. So, yeah, he just felt weak and powerless. But, you know, Ash and Go ahead basically just press And he wants to get stronger by doing that. Though. So, he wants to get stronger. Did not have that type of situation ever again, though. Which actually is pretty cool. I actually look at myself, though. So, of course, we can see Ash and Go, of course. Um, Ash and Go. Yeah, see Ash and Go. So, you meet up with Leon, and of course. Um, and by yourself, of course, it's only on Leon talk a little bit more about Ash and Go. Uh, like, I, Go was just pissed off at Ash, like, he went with Leon by himself. Of course, he didn't really warn him. Then, of course, uh, we see Ash and Leon grow a little bit more, and we see, of course, Sonya go um, reconnect. Again, we already had their episode with the Darkest Day stuff, so they really reconnected there. It was actually pretty cool. Then, of course, we got Ash and Leon, though, of course. Again, the episode ends off with them, of course, you know, training and trying to get higher and stuff like that, of course. Um, I really should say that a lot, though. But yeah, really good episode. Again, got a review to, again, with something a little bit more shorter this time around, though. So, yeah, see you guys. Yeah, shorter. Yeah. yeah, see you guys later, though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Great luck. Oh, you know, make sure you stay safe. Watch hands. God bless all of you from out for our maths on top of really, really need to, though. So, yeah, what do you think about this episode, episode though? Of course, you like it, you hate it. Had to back up a little bit. But, yeah, I like it. Um, it's a different side of Leon, pretty much, though. We get why he's training. He beat Flint, though, but he wants to get stronger because of either Red's situation. Even, like, in, like, I think it was the Generations, the weird buff Super Saiyan <laughs> Leon, uh, not looking like Rilla Bloom. He basically, um, pretty much wants to get stronger at the whole situation and stuff like that, of course, again, Ash is there to help him, help him out, balance it out. I love how they distract, like, Leon strikes Corviknight, takes off his, like, he literally go buff on tail of his Super Saiyan charge, and distracts the Corviknight, while Ash, you know, figures out what that means to, to, to the situation. And I kind of like that, like, adapting for We already got, like, a go and Sonya part kind of was going like, to force a little bit, though, but, you know, it's not forcing. Force? But yeah. Um, little stuff like that though, of course. Uh, but again, the episode was really cool. I liked it. I think it was a little good, a better, fresh take. I just felt like reviewing it just because I felt like it. The next couple episodes got a lot of good, no future episodes to get look forward to. It's utter, utter, utter craziness. It's crazy though, but it's good to see Flint kind of come back as a cameo via Seno and stuff like that, of course. Again, Devin Pro remix, we already know. But yeah. But again, the episode was really good. I liked it personally. It was actually, again, really good, really calming, really pleasing. Again, another little side episode, just something like the create not crazy balance, but just more of a side thing, you know. The person's going to do something, you know, the trainer or, or Ash or Go, help them out and stuff like that. Of course, again, typical Pokemon logic. Episode, right? So, yeah, pretty good points, pretty good stuff. Um, again, like I said, though, so yeah. Again, next up, a couple episodes will get really insane. Get a tricky, tricky, a uh, grookey evolution episode. Of course, we can see probably like grookey maybe get released, quote unquote. Just gonna go probably evolve in the episode, honestly, though. Why is he evolve in the episode? Evolving, it's evolving, evolving around its second evolution, though. So, of course, you might see it evolve. Like, you know, get a Timmy, you know, attitude nature. Because we already know girls going to evolve all in, like, the run of them. Now, let's judge the fight friends. So, yeah. But, yeah. See you guys later, though. Again, though. Peace out.